watching. Hello and welcome back to Baldur's Gate. Nope. Uh, no, well, actually, it sounds like all we need to do to do to fix your engine is find some infernal iron. I run. Is as good as he seems. Once my engine's handled, I can focus on more important matters. Tadpoles, cults, frosty pints. Hmm. No worries, no worries. Yeah. There's more where that came from. Um, we need to speak with Hassan. Scratch is unstuck after a lot of trouble. Halcyn was supposed to be here. Premium trinkets and doodads. <sighs> Where the hell is he? Okay, he is here. Like a good what the hell? <laughs> more and more problems with this game, really. It's still awesome, but... Mm. <laughs> it's okay. true, then. He's met Daniel. There's no other way he'd know that name. This is just what we needed. Well done. We need to wake him. He must know something about where to find Daniel. Okay, any ideas? If he was able to escape the shadow fell, then it mustn't have managed to consume his spirit. Well, not all of it anyway. Okay. We need to unlock whatever's left of him inside his head. There must be something to trigger him. A word, a memory, an item. We just need to find it. Sounds like we could be looking for almost anything to wake him up. I'm afraid so, yes. Let's check his person. There might be something on him to help us get started. I didn't do that already. And let me guess, I will be still in my camp. Okay, he's here now. Um, oh, wait, please don't tell me I saw that. So this is saying Daniel's name. Yeah. He must know more. Okay, I swear that I Oh my goodness. I should be able to sell that it was supposedly it should be a quest item. that because I tried to save Scratch. We still haven't visited the upper floor. Need anything? I don't know. No, apparently no. Uh, yes. Need anything? Yeah, yeah. Do you have that letter? And uh, the to put several places. Rough copy. This one. I don't know which one it could be. Not this one, that's for sure. Uh, not perfumed letter. Not case file, that one I remember. Not that one either. Oh. Oh. I'll be here if you need it. Yep, 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 yep. Um, you. This one. 
Okay. Apparently this quest item is not such of a quest item. Force mail. Force absorption. Gain force conduit when taking slashing, piercing, or bludgeoning damage. Mm hmm. No time to rest. Okay, now we can go back to housing. No, we don't go back to housing. I save the game. I don't know why they are always. They are not rested. Either. Okay. Please allow me, allow me to take a long rest, yes. We need to rest, I need my spell slots. Oh god damn it, not you! Playtime's over, pet. Can we shoot her? Oh, I love this time of year. The dickheads start popping up wherever you look. What do you want, Mizora? Drop the attitude and perk up your ears. You've got a new mission. No, Absolute thank you. cult has gone and grabbed one of Zariel's assets. A devil. And a powerful one at that. They're locked up in the cult's fortress. Moonrise Towers. And you're getting him out. If this devil is so powerful, how did they manage to get captured? Well, your playmate's wasting precious time. Let's see about getting her priorities fixed. Ahem. <clears throat> Clause Z, Section 13. Should promised soul refuse obeyance or neglect duty, the pact holder shall cast the promised into a vernus as a lemur. I'll make it simple. Will fails or refuses, and he turns to a thick blob of stink flesh and sinks to Avernus. Now, be a good boy and play fetch, pup, or you'll spend an eternity sizzling in the hells. Mazora's words may be flippant, but they are tinged with desperation. She cannot afford for Will to fail this mission. This may be your best chance to negotiate Will out of his pact. No pressure at all, really. No. Mm, easy. We'll rescue your asset on one condition. Oh, and what condition is that? Your mind links with Wills, drawn in by his increasing panic. What are you doing? Trust Will me. Will relaxes. And your connection fades. Mizora will rescue this asset if you release Will from his pact. Interesting. Now, why should I go letting my favorite pet off his leash? We could always let the cult infect the asset. I bet they would make a loyal thrall. Incredible. You actually think you hold the winning hand. Fine. I'll play your game. But I amend the pact once the mission's done, not before. Clause F. Section 9. Soulbinder shall bestow reward or favor only upon soul bearer's fulfillment of related obligation. Now, to Moonrise, pet. And do mind the shadows. They've been especially hungry. Hope you're keeping well, friend. Come here. It's so good to see you back. 
Now we just need to find that owl bear for you to play with. Why did it have to be Mizora? Why did it have to be Zariel? We're supposed to risk our necks to get one of her assets. What if it's a runaway like me? Or something far worse? Well, you heard her after that. Uh, after what Will sacrificed to save you, it's time to repay you the favor. I never forget what Will did. Not ever. I'm here because of him. And I'd do just about anything to help him. But devils never lose. You know that, right? Sure, they'll give you a bit of tat here and there. But the house always wins. I know. Soldier. Okay. Withers. Thou hast now a bosom companion. Take care that thou art not distracted on thy quest, seeking the comforts of the flesh. I will enjoy myself whenever I please. Recall that in time. All becomes dust and bone. Although I am second guessing myself. Because apparently the choices I made. Nah, never mind. Yes? I. F. Is this an E? Is it even a letter? Damn language is this! It's infernal. What the hell's you? Wait. Did you say infernal? Yes, I can read it if you turn around. I... I suppose it couldn't hurt. Benefits of being the fling! Yay! Run your eyes over the runes hacked into his flesh and recognize an all too familiar language. Infernal. It's the language of the hells. The lines describe oaths and the fires below. But the language is fragmented and strange. This is just a piece of a larger text. And? What does it say? <laughs> I love the third option. Something that... But let's be serious. Something about the first blow. It's just fragments of infernal leg leg legalese. Infernal pact? But not even the whole text. What was that bastard up to? You're welcome. If he... Mm. <laughs> Should we tell the others? Or keep it a secret? I mean... Eh. Mm. Okay, everyone basically saw it. Carla can read it, can also read it. She's also a tiefling, she was in Avernus. Hmm. We should tell the others, they might be able to help. No. No, let's keep this between ourselves. At least until we know what it means. <sighs> If this is part of a contract, then where's the rest? I wasn't his only spawn, and he tortured us all. I imagine each of us are carrying a piece of this infernal contract. But what could a devil have offered Casador? He had wealth, power, control. What more could you want? Th thank you, by the way. This is... Well, it's something. We'll figure it out. Will we? How sweet. I'm as sweet as the honey. 
but I'll give you diabetes. Um, oh, sweat. But I wasn't really expecting. Thank you. This is interesting. I don't want to talk to you right now. I don't want to get too invested. I may be too invested already. Ugh, very good relationship. Very good relationship. Fair. We'll settle for that. The more bullshit she pours, the more of it I'm forced to swallow. Mazora set me on fiends inside and outside the hells. She's never ordered a rescue. Gods. She makes a mockery of everything the blade stands for. Such an asshole. <sighs> I thought you were supposed to hand doubles. Doesn't this violate your contract? The same thought crossed my mind. I'm only to hunt the infernal, the demonic and the heartless. But nowhere was it stated that I can't help one. Either we find it, or I made a mindless blob clawing at demons on the front line of the blood war. Hmm. It's not going to happen. You mean too much to the Sword Coast. And it means everything to me. I always knew what my future held. And I know I chose right. <clears throat> Thank you for sticking your neck out for me. I mean it. But I'm not going to celebrate till I'm actually free. I can feel Mazora scheming, plotting. She won't let me go without making a fuss. Trust me on that. So, do you want to also talk with me? What can I do for you? We've been talking with lots of uh, and lots. Is Mistra always such a demanding goddess? She expects those who seek to use the weave to do so honestly and with respect for its potential to destroy as well as its potential to save. I doubt she's asked many of her followers to blow themselves up. That's a fate she's bequeathed exclusively to me. She wouldn't ask such a thing if it weren't our only means of survival. However much she's annoyed at me. How are you feeling? It can be easy, facing the possibility of death. Oh, you know me, ever the optimist. I'm trying to focus on the positives. Truth is, I was living on borrowed time already. Consuming those items would only have kept the orb sated for so long. If anything, I feel more at peace than I have in months. At least now I know my death will have purpose. It won't be a distant bang in the footnotes of history. Well, why doesn't a minister take on the Absolute, or Mistra herself? I've no doubt she has the power to do so, but as for the permission, Ao would not look kindly on her meddling in mortal affairs. Divine intervention has a tendency to make things worse, not better. As for Elminster, he saved the realms more times than legend can recount. But to take on a god is no easy feat, even for him. My orb is the best chance we have. And only I can wield it. Okay. Anyone else left? Uh, yeah. The gods are watching me. Lazel. Greetings. Okay. Actually, uh, who has it? You. Give me those. Actually, give me those items. Along with this. And this. Because I'm fairly sure we will need that. Mm -hmm. Is that blood? No, never mind. You know. I've been catching myself smiling more lately. I think that's your fault. Kefri Tong, what do you think of him? Difficult to say. A fellow servant of the Night Singer would surely be an ally to me under most circumstances. But something doesn't add up. I'll need to see where his allegiances truly lie. Okay. 
please stay in the camp. If you're sure. Mm hmm. Fine. I'll be here whenever you rediscover your tasting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I want to give you word. some armor. Greetings. It is done. Great. I oh, should have up. Let's see. We'll go through it. Come on. Thank you. Eager for battle. Let's level her up. New feet for you. Hmm. When attacked for wielding a finesse weapon, you're proficient with, you can use reaction to add your proficiency bonus to your armor class. Ooh! Or maybe Mage Slayer. That would be nice as well. Uh, Sentinel? When an enemy within melee range attacks an ally, you can use a reaction to make weapon attack against an enemy. Target ally must not have the Sentinel feet. Yes! Okay. Let's see. Attacks can plant. Yep. Can I see it? Uh, she gains plus one athletics. We really nothing better. See? She doesn't have any rings. Oh. <laughs> well. <sighs> it's... Wait, 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 wait. Uh, it's versatile. Can be used with one hand or both. There's more damage when moves in both hands. Okay. How can I toggle that it to be held with both hands? Never mind. How can you use that big ass sword in one hand? Oh, I, uh, I think you cannot use. This one she uses in both hands. Like. By default. Is there somewhere? <laughs> mm, I'm not sure if there if it's somewhere here. She can no oh, never mind. Okay. All's well that ends. Let's go to sleep. Not as bad as it could have. Oh. Who? It's come to this. We're blind. of the absolute is strong here and getting stronger I don't know how much longer I can resist it but it's good to see you're making progress <sighs> you took an unexpected route here you did a brave thing Saving those people in the grove. Hmm. It doesn't seem like my help did the match good. The cult has caught, the, caught up with them. Don't be so hard on yourself. It's not your fault the world is wicked. You did the right thing. It just doesn't stop. 
We are being bombarded by waves of telepathic energy. Wave after wave with hardly a breath between them. I almost dare not rest. Each wave a set of orders to the infected. The order for your transformation has been given many times already. I just hope my powers last long enough to see this through. Okay, let's venture out then. Wait, who's crying? What path lies before me? Oh, it's the okay. It's the feeling over there. How's the, the new day. Thanks. The new upgrade. I was wondering where you'd run off to. Well, two things: good news and bad news. Give us the good news. I only need one more piece of infernal iron to craft an insulating chamber that can make it possible for Carlic to touch people. Exactly. Oh my God, it's really happening. It's been so long. We've got the iron. Let's do this thing. Hang on. I think you'll want to hear the bad news too. Yeah, sure. But first, fix me. Please. Go on. Oh, let him speak. This sounds important. Fine. Well, go on then. I don't enjoy saying this, Karlak. But there's no two ways about it. Your engine is going to blow and I can't fix it. I'm not sure anyone can. It's simply too hot to exist here in the material plane. Unless you return to Avernus, for good, this thing is going to blow. Sooner rather than later. But... But still, you, you can give me something that will let me touch again, right? Safely? Yes, but... That's all I need to know. Do it. Please. Let's make it happen. Well. All right. This shouldn't take long. Same as last time. You'll need to install it yourself. This should do the trick. There. So did it... work? Only one way to find out. Believe it. Thank you, Dallon. Thank you so much. It's the least I could do. Before you go, there's something I need to tell you. That engine of yours. It's contained for the moment, but it's just too hot to exist here in the material plane indefinitely. I know you know that. But the thing is, there's a cure. I wasn't making any headway with the mechanics, none at all. The environment here is just too cold to sustain metals like the ones inside you. You have to return to Avernus. For good. Or this thing is going to burn you up from the inside out. And sooner than you think. 
The minute I set foot back in Avernus, Zarya will force me back into service. I'm not doing her bidding again. I'd rather die. I get that, but don't rule it out. The world just might be better with you in it. Even in Avernus. I won't stop trying to figure out a cure, but... At this point, I think we all have to face the inevitable. Don't look at me, it's her choice. First things first. Carla, you have your touch back. We ought to celebrate. Right? All this doom and gloom. I have something far more exciting on my mind than this bloody tin box. Thanks, Damon. Really, you've given me more than I could ever repay. It's been my pleasure. Good luck, both of you. Look after yourself, all right? Tiefling party. Cleric's magic won't hold out the darkness forever. This is the best day. The best day! I'm so happy for you. I'm so happy for me too. Now I just need to find someone to cuddle up to tonight and I'll be the happiest woman on the Sword Coast. Anyone in mind? I'm not sure. Depends who's got me in mind. Withers was giving me the old eye the other night. Then again, maybe it was just an old eye. Hmm. What about what Damon said about your entering? We need to get you... No! Mm. I'll just leave it at this. Really? Bringing it back at Vernus now? No! <laughs> I refuse. Okay, let's get up here now. Oh, wait. Um, let's see... Do I have any particular scrolls? How do those scrolls work? Until long rest, great! Speak of animals... Speak with animals... That's all. Do you have any scrolls? Have a gander at the finest stock. Turn the creature invisible. Visible by wearing for the increasingly harder stealth checks on attacking, casting spells, or interacting with items. Okay, so I'll leave this at that. I'll give you detecting thoughts. Oh, it's concentration. Oh well. These boots have seen everything. Okay, let's be ready for whatever we see over there. Oh no, the game froze. What the heck? Oh, by the way, do you have something you want to cast? I crave blood. Uh, let's give you. Charisma? No, West, there's no constitution? No. That takes... Sure, I want to see that. Uh, Hunter's Mark... Ooh. Oh, it works for 10 turns. Hello! Don't mind if I do. Ever since I returned, there's been a filth in me. I feel it never lungs. I cannot get it out. It will never out. This death that freaks within me. There are some things even the Moon Maiden cannot heal. 
There are some things she would never accept in her devoted. I should never have come back. I'm definitely saving before meeting with you. I didn't realize I had an audience. The true soul who's going to save us all. I'm Isabel. Pleased to meet you. Hmm. And you, I've heard you're the protector of the sin, the banisher of shadows. Myself and Our Lady are doing what we can to hold the line. I hear you and your tadpole will be our offense. Free from the Absolute's influence, yet able to walk among cultists. It's almost too good to be true. But I'd be a poor cleric indeed not to avail of a blessing when I see one. Let Give me, me guess. Jahira sent you to beg a protection spell of her favorite cleric. Perfect. It'll make you immune to the lesser effects of the Shadow Curse, which will get you closer to the towers. But there are places it won't help. Places where the curse is darker, stronger. The cultists are able to traverse even the deepest shadows, though. I don't know how. The Harpers are trying to figure it out. Thank you. I uh, now I must take my leave. Good luck. And may the Moon Maiden protect you. While you're busy in the towers, I'll be sure to... Wait. Do you hear that? Something's wrong. This singing is creepy. <sighs> Hello, Isabel. Marcus, is that you? What's happened to you? I've been blessed. You can be too. Come with me, and you can hear all about it from Ketherick himself. Why he looks like Lord Farquaad from Shrek. Isabel, do you know this man? He's a flaming fist. Or was. He came with the others when we created this haven. And I thank you for your hospitality. True soul. My instructions are clear. Take the girl to Ketherick, alive. What does he want with her? What's going on? If you have something to say, say it. He's trying to kidnap you. Pathetic. The Absolute sees all. Your treachery will be punished. What treachery? The Absolute. Of course. You can't believe them, Marcus. Ketherick will never give you whatever it is you've been promised. <laughs> he already has. Time to go, Isabel.
No, that's... That's just gotten personal. Okay, so apparently for some reason my recording stopped when the fight started and now we are, we are in the middle of it. Yep. Huh. And maybe... You guys are doing great! We have a possibility to save her, I think. Uh, yeah. Oh, I know you can do another action. Captain. Maybe it would be better if you wouldn't be wasting your spells like that. Nice. Okay. That's those three. I think. Don't tell me it broke because <laughs> they are turned. Okay. Okay, I want you to stand here. In case anyone tries to go past me. Past the door. You won't take her. No. <laughs> you picked the wrong fight, friend. It's okay. Unfortunately, it ends the turn undead, but... Good job. Uh, okay. Thank you. Okay, only three left. Hmm. Might as well. Can't reach destination. Can you jump over there? No, of course you can. Just in case he tries to move. Can you jump behind? That is interrupted. Oh. That was interesting. Collect it. It might be useful. Sure. If only I can wait a bit more. Isabel, are you all right? I'm fine. <coughs> Marcus has been with us since the start. They've been tracking us this whole time. And that was no random attack. You were the target, Isabel. They know how important you are. But they don't know about you. Ketherick will strike again. 
We need you to strike first. Discover the source of his invulnerability. Make him mortal so we can make him bleed. Good luck. I am... Mm. in more danger than I knew. If something happens to me, everyone in this inn is dead. Like that. Marcus told me Gefferic wanted you captured, not killed. Why? Why does a man like him do anything? Power, spite, some kind of twisted personal morality. I can understand why he'd want me dead. Without me keeping the curse at bay, everyone in this inn, everyone intent on killing him, is dead too. As for why he'd want to take me alive, I don't know. And I don't want to find out, now that we have you. I hope I won't have to. I'm getting tired of hearing that. You'll have time for irrelevance when you're dead. For now, we need you. No mercy. For Ketherick will have none on you. End this. Okay, if you don't mind, I'd like to take his, his stuff in visibility, sure. Great club plus one, sure, we're gonna sell it, gold and might play a parasite. Okay. Anything else you want to say? On with you. Unless you want to come back to a gaggle of shadow cursed harpers. Mm. Okay. Oh, if you love it. Well, at least I don't have to take part in cleaning this mess. You. You need to learn how to not cast Ice Storm inside the buildings. Fireballs are one thing, but Ice Storm can be quite dangerous. Traitors among us. A child taken. And still I can only feel relief. If they had taken Isabel too, I... I assume you have some payback in mind. <laughs> You know me already, but you will have the honor of making up for my blunder here. I trust that you will. Okay. It's, no, I don't really like her. I don't really want to continue conversations with her. Ish. Considerations. You mean to reach Moonrise, and I have orders to help you. The path to the towers is drenched in blackness so deep even a torch cannot quell it. Yet the cultists have found a way to move freely. Whatever this method, you must claim it. A cultist convoy crosses the land as we speak. I've readied an ambush. Say the word, and we fly. The word. Um. <laughs> Let's take on that convoy. I lead, you lead, I follow. Splendid. I'll mark your map should you lose the way. Thanks. Alpha's with me. Stray no more than an arm's length from your course. Yeah, let's follow them straight away. If we can get. We're closing in. Ready? Okay, uh, if we can get probably the moon lanterns is what keeps them safe. Looks like there was a struggle here. And the key, you see, that's why you check 50% of the bodies you find. Let's take care of the convoy. This way.
Of course, I'm the one who's supposed to be lead. Oh, okay. To your church every day, my queen. Your followers are legion. Go. We'll wait for your signal. Will stand ready, Majesty. Soon will march. Soon the world will bow to you. Signal? Here, where boss? Something moved up there. Want me to drag it out? Mm, stay hidden in the bottom. Stay in the light. They do not go into the dark. Didn't figure something as big and ugly as you for a coward. Go into the dark! Enough! Stop! They will not become shadows! They will not feed the curse! Forgive me, my queen, but I had to before the dark got any stronger. Hmm. Try to fade into the background? Let's think of a trickster. Okay, so it's either one. I advantage is better. We will carry your light, Majesty. We are happy to serve. The hells are you waiting for? Attack! Heretics! Blasphemers! Kill them all! No. Sanctuary. Okay. Mm. Uh, you can attack him, but you need to make a roll against it. So uh, that's not entirely true. What they are trying to show here? Okay. Over here. I fear neither shadow nor death. What the f is wrong with you? Well, but it only lasts one one turn. Usually, it lasts. Uh, One Ignis. Okay, he's still standing. Hmm. Angle for target. I mean, okay. You, oh, we cannot. I mean, yeah, but click your boots. God damn it. An improvement. 
And I keep forgetting to use her rage. Right, there's still that one guy there. You help me. And that's everything you can do. You do misty step up here. See ya! Oh, no, counter spell. That was fireball, not firebolt. If I saw correctly, so... No, thank you. Affected entity can be targeted by enemy attacks or spells. However, it can still take damage from spells that influence a larger RER condition. And if the affected entity attacks or harms another creature, and will receive sanctuary blocked for one turn. Don't you have like? That's too much. What do you have? Oh, heal yourself. Hmm, she can just cleave. Wait, what? Uh, prepare cleave. At least she attacked. So. It's not bad. Light on my feet. Killing ward. I'm really having horrible rolls on it. hit him. Keep on hitting him. We need to kill him this turn. <laughs> well, Karlak is on the right track. So many stuff was so what? I what? Long sword. The lantern gives off a chilly glow, protecting all in its vicinity from the surrounding shadows. Incredible magic! I can feel the light lifting the shadows. Even those within me. Be safe and be brave. We expect no less. Thanks. It is a tiny pixie trapped within. These fey creatures are infamous for their trickery. Sometimes playful, sometimes malicious. Oh please, oh golly, me oh my. You must release me or I'll die. This lantern only lights the way when I am hurting night and day. 
Legends tell of the fate trapping people, not the other way around. Why are you in here? My pixie dust is bright as day. My injuries can light the way. It seems like a fitting punishment for a poet. What's this mechanism at the base of the lantern? I dare not name it, newfound friend. The faintest touch could spell my end. Hmm. I don't even know if I can trust you, honestly. This would kill her, I'm fairly sure this also can kill her. I don't know. And I'm gonna end this part here, so for now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye!